A Twin Cities woman is putting the sudden downturn in retail to good use. As WCCO's Liz Collin found, the extra time forced Sarah to revisit her passion and protect others in the process. About 30 minutes to make each mask. With a college degree in apparel design, Sarah Murphy worked her way up to a retail manager at a big name store. It took an unexpected three month break to sit the 28 year old from Plymouth back in front of her sewing machine. I was furloughed during the pandemic and I was at home and, you know, I had all this fabric corded and so I decided to make some face masks. It's how Masks by Sarah was born. Murphy came up with her own pattern, complete with nose wire, silk lining, and filter pocket all with a flair for fashion. Also making reversible ones. So we have this one that is a brocade on the outside, but then on the inside it's a leopard, snow leopard print. Upcycling material from old dresses and pajamas, Murphy takes all requests. She's sold hundreds to people across the country for $20 a piece. And for every mask she makes, she donates another to different charities. You said this was sort of a way for you to follow uh, the reason you got into to this industry in the first place, to go back to your real passion. Yeah, it's definitely my real passion of creating and sewing. Murphy will keep moving her new business forward, even as she's back at work, staying safe, in style. I think the hardest part is getting started. Liz Collin, WCCO 4 News. If you'd like to know more about Masks by Sarah, you'll find a link on WCCO.com.